certain people who will never drive anything but a fabric top convertible. It has always been a sportier looking car, lower, better style. Despite the occasional inconvenience of the convertible, like leaving the car with the top down and having it suddenly rained on, some convertible owners love more than anything else the airy, light feeling of driving with only a fabric cover above them. A cover that can be whisked away in seconds to leave them free as the open air or closed in seconds to protect them from the elements. Fabric top lovers there are, and fabric top lovers there will always be. And then there's another type of automobile buyer. Here's a man who's always wanted a convertible. Maybe he even used to own one and remembers it with pleasure. But for one or more various reasons, perhaps concern for his family, for example, many a man who would like to own a convertible must insist on the solidity and security of a steel roof car and resign himself never to enjoy the pleasures of an open automobile. Up to now, the closest such a man could come to his desires was the so-called hardtop convertible, which, of course, is not really a convertible at all. But people have been working on this problem. It has long been the dream of automotive designers to perfect the true hardtop convertible, a car with a steel roof, that would retract out of sight, leaving an open-air car. However, design after design has been rejected as impractical. That is, until today. Today, Ford, which led the industry to the V8, to ball joint suspension, to modern styling, and to many, many other engineering and design advances, once again proves its leadership of the automotive world with the Fairlane 500 Hideaway Hardtop. Here is the car of the future. The car that other manufacturers are still only dreaming about. The car that brings great prestige to Ford and Ford dealers for being first to offer the hard top design that within 10 years will be almost standard in the industry. Longer, three inches longer than the Fairlane 500 Sunliner. Heavier, weighing almost 250 pounds more than its cloth top counterpart. The Fairlane 500 Hideaway Hardtop is the most beautiful car on the road today. Just look at the flat, streamlined roof that signals another new kind of Ford. Indeed, a new kind of car. Yes, just look at it. about 50 seconds, less than a minute to change from a hard top to an open air car, the world's first and only true hard top convertible. That's the Fairlane 500 Hideaway Hard Top. How is this miracle of automotive engineering accomplished? How in the world does it work? Seven small electric motors, permanently sealed and lubricated for their lifetime, provide the power to operate the fully automatic top. A system of limit switches operates the motors in sequence for safe, dependable operation. The top can be raised or lowered with the ignition key in the accessory position or with the engine running. However, the transmission must be in neutral for the sake of safety. Then simply push in and hold the top operating button, and the automatic mechanism takes over completely. Let's watch the top move up into place. First. The deck lid rises. 
When fully open, the lid hits a limit switch, which starts the top raising motor. The top moves up and forward. As it does so, a system of levers pulls the front roof section gradually into position. Finally, the entire top drops down and is electrically locked in place by the electric top locking motor. Now the package tray is folded under for storage. When folded completely, it hits a limit switch which starts the deck lowering motor. When the deck is completely lowered, it too is electrically locked into position by another locking motor. Amazingly enough, the entire top mechanism is so perfectly counterbalanced that the top can be raised or lowered and locked by the seven small motors using no more current than a cloth top convertible. And all motors, remember, are permanently sealed and lubricated for their lifetime. To provide maximum space for the top and the rear deck, the spare tire is under a floor plate where it can be easily reached on those rare occasions when it is needed. How about luggage? Where does that go? There's room for plenty of luggage in the rear deck, more even than in the Sunliner convertible. And to reach it, simply hold the operating button in the raised position until the deck lid is fully open. Release the button, the mechanism stops, and your luggage is at your fingertips. Luggage space is, of course, limited when the top is down, but people rarely take long trips in an open car. When you've removed the luggage you need, simply press the button the other way to lower, and the deck lid moves back into place, securely locked. Notice, too, that fueling of the hideaway hardtop is accomplished through an access door in the left rear fender. And that about finishes up the major styling and engineering differences between the new hideaway hardtops and other Fairlane 500s. The new Fairlane 500 hideaway hardtop. A beautiful new kind of car. A major contribution to automotive design that you would expect from Ford, the leader of the industry. Here is a car that will join America's favorite convertible in offering the wonderful pleasures of open-air driving to the public. All the strength, solidity, and security of a steel top, plus a truly remarkable engineering accomplishment to achieve the world's first and only hideaway hard top. It's the car of the future, and once again, the industry will have to follow the leader, Ford.